Hello, my name is Lewis and welcome to Gathering the Magic. And today we are opening up another mystery booster box. Now obviously before we get started, don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe for more MTG box openings and all of that good stuff. And you know already what we're looking for here. We're looking for the Mana Crypt. We're looking for the Demonic Tutor. We're looking for another Silvala. And Acetism is the first. That's the old card we got there. And Yuriko. Okay. Very nice. That is a cool start to the video. One of my friends has this deck and it is absolutely ridiculous. It's a wicked card. And Geth's Grimoire is the foil in this pack. I really wanted to do another mystery booster box as the last one went down really well and they're just probably they're probably the most fun set to open again we'll just we'll flick through the commons and commons might miss out a valuable one or two but we all know those big slots are right at the back salte soothsayer jungle hollow phantom center for the vintage card and goblin pile driver for the rare could be wrong, but I don't think that's worth anything. And we've got, oh, nice foil from, is that from Time Spiral? We've got Conspiracy. Choose a creature, creature cards you own. Ah, I play Creature Project Control. That is a very cool card. Yeah, like I said, I just really like this set. I don't know if it's because there's like, what, four, 1400 is it? Maybe 1400 cards in this set. It's just something, something ridiculous. Now there's, there's over a thousand commons, so the chance of getting multiples are pretty small. Let's have a look. Nest Invader, Greenwood Sentinel. Okay, so Draxis Spectre for the Multicolored. Blighted Fen for the land. Okay, we've got a Gilt Leaf Palace. Pretty cool land there. And Nin, the Pain Artist for the rare. And what is our foil going to be? Zer's Wielding. Players play with their hands revealed. Very cool. Yeah, I've opened two of these boxes before. Once, uh, about a month or so on the channel, um, and then one before before this little channel ever existed. And in both ones, I've managed to get Teferi's Protection. So are we gonna get a third Teferi's Protection? I really hope so. Ah, Sam Kozalek. Okay, Avalanche Riders for that old slot. Memory Erosion in this rare and the Foil Spring Jack Shepherd Goats for Days. In the last video, I did say I really wanted above everything, like, I really did want over everything a Kiki Jiki, and I got that. And this time, I really want an Elish Norn. So that is that is that is the aim for this video, obviously. If we get a mana crypt, that's that's the big dog. But I really want an Elish Norn Renegade map. Violet, Violet, Violent Ultimatum there. Alhamrat's Archive. Okay, now this is a good pull. This is, I think there's about 30 Mythics in this set. And this one is around the $10 range, I believe. That's pretty cool. Okay. And we've got one of these double double flip, whatever you want to call them, from Champions of Kamigawa. Very, very nice. Okay, we'll go on to the next pack now. Moving on fast. Get through all these little ones that are really barely ever worth more than a few pence. If they are, I'll try and catch up when I edit, put the value on there. And let's have a look. Brimstone Dragon is the rare, or the old, the old card, and look at that art. That is pretty damn cool. Okay, Aminatu's Augury for the rare, and that is very, very good in a Narset deck, I'll tell you now. And foil, we've got Celestial Dawn, land you control our planes. That is a beautiful card. Uh, if you haven't already, do check out our Instagram, well, we have just wrapped up a nice little giveaway for a partner pairing pirate themed deck, which is going out to um, the guy that won it shortly. 
And uh, yeah, do check out the Instagram if you wanna, I think we are gonna plan to do another little giveaway when we hit 500 subscribers on this channel, so that's pretty cool. Burnished Heart, and we've got Pestilence there, and that is Urza's Saga card. Very, very nice. Okay, Arch of Oraska. Again, another rare that I seem to get in every one of these boxes. And Marrow Nora. Lovely little card for those rat tribals. And one last plug whilst I'm plugging away all the all the gathering the magic stuff. If you are signed up to Card Market, make sure to use our code gathering dash the dash magic because it will just help out the channel a little bit. And that'll be a really nice thing to do for me for Christmas. Okay, forgotten K okay, for that landslide. Phyrexian Soul Gorger for the old, old card slot, which is a really cool card. Torian Mauler, Changeling, not one that I've packed before. And we have a Glittering Wish in that foil slot. There we go. Okay, that's a third of this box done. No, no showstoppers so far. I mean, you've got the Al Hamrit's Archive, which is probably the biggest, biggest hitter. Uh, but again, all it takes, all it takes is one Mana Crypt. And I'll tell you now, if I get a Mana Crypt, first thing I'm gonna do is buy another box of this. Because that's that's how how the world works, isn't it? Circle, circle of life with magic cards. Dragon Mask, that is wicked. That is such a cool card. Craig Hooper, little signature there. There we go for the old slot. Odric Lunar Marshall. Again, really cool card to use in Commander, but not worth anything at all. And Lantern of Insight for that foil slot. And what a nice little foil that is. Come on, Elish Norn, where are you? I've got, a, I've got a feeling, I've got a feeling this is a good pack. I'm usually, I'm usually right. I'm, I'm good when I predict it's gonna be a big pack and this is gonna be, this is gonna be a huge pack. Nothing, nothing big throughout these, but that's fine. It's just setting us up for what's gonna be an incredible mythic, right? Oh, <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God, that is ridiculous. That is ridiculous. I usually call it once a video, and once again, I'm not wrong. Ristic Study, that is huge. That is amazing. Wow, wow, wow. Fun fact, I actually ordered a Ristic Study um, a few weeks ago, but the guy had to cancel because he, he got the old COVID and couldn't leave the house two weeks, so my whole order got canceled. And Prey sees a dragon in that rare slot, but who cares about that? And Spell Tithe Enforcer. No, no idea how much those two are worth, but that Rhystic Study, oh, that is, that is worth a few quid. That is brilliant. Okay, and Rhystic Study can go right there, have its own slot. And don't you worry, card collectors and protectors. The first thing I do once I finish filming is run straight to my living room and grab all those little sleeves and protectors and get them straight in there. I just uh, don't have the biggest amount of space here around me, so it's not really worth doing a rankle there. Extracts from darkness. Oh, what a pack that was. What a pack that was. Wild Nactal. No idea how much that is worth. Just a one, one for one. It's pretty damn cool. Reality Scramble for the rare. Nice. And what have we got here? Rescue from the Underworld. Nice little foil. Oh, I'm still, I'm still buzzing from that rustic study. That is, that is class. Oh, I did it in my 36 pack booster. I called, I called the pack that I got an Oco in, or well, the the Throne of Eldraine pack, obviously. But yeah, and I've done it in a few other videos. Just saying, saying this pack is going to be the pack. Oh, nice Gary. And uh, yeah, wow, that was a hell of a pack. Cultivate, Underworld, Coinsmith. Okay, Whisker, oh, that's a, a lovely, lovely card. Not worth anything, but do like that card in Commander. And we have an Eldrazi, Path Razor of Ulamog, Annihilator 3. I'd love to go full filthy and have a Eldrazi deck one day, as I've not done that so far. And Sewer Nemesis, Enemy of the Rats. 
coming in there for the rare and Mirrodin's Court for the foil. So I've got one really, really good blue pull. Am I gonna get another another card I really want that I've not got from this set so far is that old expropriate. That would be wicked with Ring Cloudscape. Yeah, I really want expropriate. I just love to love to use that. I love random well, I love politics in Commander, but I love I love randomness as well. Gruel Signet. Oh, okay. Another another good pull from that old card slot, Sorin Markov. Another card that I've got in each now of the three booster boxes. You clearly like printing Sorin, and it is still worth quite a few quid. And Coveted Jewel. Draw three cards, add three manner of any colour. A lovely wicked rock there. And Memnite. <laughs> a naught one one. This is probably worth one dollar at most. <laughs> okay, coming towards the end of, oh no, maybe not, three packs left still in this second slot. Oh, Rhystic Study, obviously with Al Hamrit's Archive and Sorin Markov, we've got, we've got a few good pulls here. I mean, I don't know if it'll be as big as the last box. The last box was absolutely quality. And if you've not seen it, I'll put a little link in the top right corner now and go Go give it a watch. Sorcerer's Broom and Douthy Mind Ripper. Uh, what's that? Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. There we go. It's just like Christmas come early. I say what I want and I get it. Expropriate. That is that is an absolutely class pull. What do I want next? I want a Mana Crypt. I want a Mana Crypt. Expropriate and Bale Fire Liege. Oh, that is beautiful. Expropriate can can take its little place there. <laughs> Amazing. Okay, so we've already got like two of the top 10 most valuable cards in this set. Now, are we gonna get the Mana Crypt? I can't believe that, I said. I said, didn't I? I called it, I wanted an Expropriate. I got an Expropriate. Let's have a look. Another Eldrazi, here we go. The Eldrazi deck coming on whilst this video goes. Umbral Mantle, really cool untap untap effect tireless tracker another one again worth a few quid it is definitely a good pull and who doesn't love a little clue and isamaru hound of konda champions of kamigawa nothing special i mean a one drop white two two yes it's all right then okay and now we are on to the last part of the second load of piles. That, that was a bad sentence. I don't know what that was. Okay, let's get through these. Nice land. Okay, and we've got some squirrel wranglers. There we go. Lovely old vintage card and caged sun. Got that in the last video. Nice little card to use and again worth a quid or two. And Viscera Seer recently made its return in Commander Legends, but now we've got, well, an old new version of it in foil. Very nice. Oh, almost, almost feels like fate that. My, uh, my Rhystic Study order being cancelled, then packing it here. Oh, beautiful. Okay, let's flick through the commons, because no one comes for the commons, do they? Thran Dynamo, that is a lovely card just to pack, just to put in those other commander decks that I'd be brewing. Phantasmal Dragon for the old slot. Gin of Wishes for the rare. I, 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 again, I don't know why so many cards. I do that. It's almost like I think they're all foil, but this one is foil, so we will do it. Nice little Boros Damager there. Aurelia's Fury. Oh, I get so excited doing these mystery boosters. And this one is no different. I think we're in the final third now. We've already got a few really good cards. You might think that nothing else good is coming, but I've just got that feeling, you know. This is going to be the, the next level. Oh, there we go. Some Cascade. Some old Cascade. This is going to be another wicked box, isn't it? Master Transmuter. And Mind Shatter. Nice card. Nice, nice, nice. 
and we've got Maro, another card that I get in every mystery booster box. They love to print and I love to just stack them up in my collection. Okay, is this the pack? Is this the Mana Crypt pack? And I just start screaming and then have to put a, a headphone warning. Ruin rat. Okay, let's get through these. Tatiova, that is cool and common to get. Guardians of Miletus. Helm of Awakening. That's a that's a cool old card for you there. That is very nice. Drana. Oh, okay. Okay. Again, I'm not sure how much this is worth, but again, it's a good pull. It's a card that I've kind of wanted anyway. That's nice. And Suke Son of Shashira. Lots of champions of Kamigawa in this set, isn't there? Lots. But that, that's wicked art. That is wicked. Okay. Half a dozen or so left. Let's see what we get. So look, if you are still watching, thank you very much. And why not? Why not pop a reason why you love Prickly Marmoset so much in the comments below? Just show me, show me that you're still watching. That'd be really cool. Fopter Foundry for the artifact. Bottle of Gnomes. <laughs> what a great card. Uh, and that's like Bow of Nylea. Okay. Really, really cool card there. Attacking creatures you control have Death Touch. Nice. Spawning grounds in the rare slot. You can enchant land, tap it, and then create a 5 5 green beast creature token with trample. Not too bad. And Helix Pinnacle. Oh, again, I think I've packed this in every box so far. But one, it's worth a few quid. And two, it's just if you get to use this and pull it off, then, then you're a legend. Oh, as you can see there, that was a very that was a very green pack. But you know what we want now? We I've got a butcher that. We want a white pack. Give me to fairies. Oh, Aura of Silence. Another card that was in the order of Rhystic Study that didn't, that, that got cancelled. Nice. Okay. So yeah, we want that white pack, don't we? We want to fairies protection. We want Elish Norn. Are we going to get it? Let's get through these. Guys, Blessing, Wayfaring Temple, Darksteel Citadel, Dominus of, oh, that's just, that's just lots of words, isn't it? <laughs> Chaos Warp. Okay. Another really, really cool card. I'm, I, you know what? I'm really happy with these pulls in this box. This has been a nice random bunch of cool stuff. And Fungasaur, 8th edition. Whenever it's dealt damage, put a plus one, plus one counter on it. Okay, three packs left. Yeah, I don't know value-wise if this money has been made back, but it's just been a really good good box I've, I've enjoyed it i've got a lot of pulls i've got some cards that i wanted and hopefully this has been a good little watch nice little tome there sapphire charm in that old start like one drop blue that's cool mimic that card that i had in one of my pre-cons for ages and i just kept getting confused with it so i took it out <laughs> okay and then we've got stigma lasher in that foil slot and again lovely art okay penultimate packs you know what only uh only two packs to go i don't think there's going to be any oh riffling class i don't think there's going to be any legendary pulls here but i'm just i'm happy with what i've got that's absolutely fine bone saw zero mana artifact elixir of immortality in that retro slot Basilisk Collar, okay, okay. Again, only worth a few quid, but it's just it's just such a good card to have. One, and we've got your Tiller Nephilim. There we go. Okay, last pack. Are we gonna get that last pack look? Don't know what the tapping's about, but I feel like it'll help. Okay, flick through the commons. Flea, Fire and Ice, Fire and Ice, Ghost Quartet, Magus of the Moat, and what we're going to have, Deep Glow Skate, okay, so nothing, nothing really that special, Myogen of Life's Web, another Champions of Kamigawa, Foil, yeah, there we go, 
that was a very, very enjoyable box. And if you want to see more, more Mystery Booster, more Command Legends, just let me know. Meanwhile, let me just show you the three best cards in Magic. Here we go, Expropriate, Rustic Study, and a card that isn't in Mystery Booster. Actually, it came out after Mystery Booster, didn't it? Oh well, yeah. Thank you for watching. Uh, for now, I am all tapped out, so I'll see you in the next video.